we're going to start the, we're going to start this interview out with job done good job done great pass to win this thing on the outside did you set him up a, a couple laps did you think you had the measure of him yeah always here um you have to set him up but uh all work out really well this time yes it is really job done big time yes but when he passed you, did you think, okay, no problem? I, I, you were so good coming off a of two. Yes, um, we had a great car, and um, I know this place recently you don't want to read too much, right? You you, you want to come to the second, third, last ten laps, and then you'll be on a second on the last lap. But while, while I was leading, um, you, you just kept going, and I know Hello is coming and big charge into lap three to go on the town one and we side by side but this time I am um, right pointing right direction so does this make up for almost winning it a few years ago always fresh back you know 2012 with Dario going to town one and uh, it was a big lesson you know it's always learning something this time we proved we were here did you ever when you started racing and stuff Formula One everything did you ever think this would ever happen no no this is it's just Never believe, never, never happened like this way. And uh, this is the best place to win the race. Not physical times, you know, we had an exciting race today, but this is a history. And this is like, I, I, the fans going crazy, fantastic. That's what I was going to say. The fans gave you a great ovation. I think they appreciate your spirit. Thank you very much. I, I love this race. Job done. <laughs> Long Beach, job done. Indianapolis, Takuma Sato, congratulations, brother. Thank you. All right, Garrett. Uh, I know the Honda guys couldn't watch the last five laps and half the crew. You've been his engineer before and you come back this year stronger. When he got passed for the lead, did you think, oh, or did you think, oh, he's, he's been really good coming off too, we still got him? After watching his qualifying and the Sammy Swindell slide job he did there, I had absolutely no worries. I knew he could hold on to just about anything and he was not going to settle for anything but first. He's always been fast. He's had the propensity to crash more probably more than he wants to, but he seems, you guys have seemed to settle him down. Is it this atmosphere of the team? Is it you being reunited with you? Is it both? It's the influence of this team. I mean, whether you talk about Michael or Brian, you know, these guys are champions in themselves, and it just comes through to him, and it's about a large group helping him to do it. Also, just the caliber of the team he's with. I mean, he has the equipment now, and that makes a lot less more mistakes. Uh, when he went for the pass on the outside to take the lead again, I said two things. He was either going to make it or hit the wall. As his engineer, I mean, that, that's why the people react to him. I think they like his spirit. Oh, the, you got to love him for that kind of thing. I mean, he had no attack, no chance. That's his mantra. <laughs> and we've been going at it for six years about that. But you knew he was going to go for it. But I knew the car was capable of it. So it was really never a worry. But not too many guys could make that outside pass stick, and he did. He got to the front doing that a couple times. Yeah, well, you know, the, 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 the discipline we've had throughout the week, working with all of his teammates, I mean, that's what really makes it happen. This isn't the first time he's been there. He's done that several times this week. And it's working with your teammates and knowing what you can get away with the car. That's, that's what makes it happen. Most, most fun you've ever had? Best victory you've ever had? Oh, by far the best victory I've ever had. We've been working, uh, I've got two second place here with Carlos, and now Takuma Kaimli finally came in and finished it off. Of the five full-time cars, Garrett, he probably was fifth on the depth chart for projected wins. So that, that's kind of a, an upset too, especially if you see how the month went. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of talent in this team. But, you know, there was no number one, two, three, four, five. We all knew we had capable machines, and we knew that, you know, if we were all up there at the end, it was going to be one through five. It's just a question of we happen to survive everything. Yep. You know, it's too bad for Ryan. It's too bad for Fernando. I mean, they had good cars.